Hi, this is Jason from DTB Traders. If you are trading on the NinjaTrader 8 platform and looking to increase your consistency using a free tool, then this is the video for you. We're going to cover how this one effective tool can make all the difference. A simple method to trade this tool that you can implement right away and how there's no need to look anywhere else. This tool can make all the difference for you. How to go about acquiring this tool, setting it up to generate consistent results. And after you have gained consistency using it, what are your next steps? So it is important to understand that trading does involve risk. So if you have set up a trading account, you would have had to sign a risk disclosure agreement. So it's definitely important to go and review that because that is going to help you understand what trading is and what it is not. So I've included mine over here, but please go and review your own. The NinjaTrader 8 platform is a very effective trading platform. And if you want to know more about it, if you're not using it already, please visit ninjatrader.com for more information. It helps us show accurate results on charts. It helps us trade the futures market without broker manipulation, which is very powerful. And I have also recorded a video on how scammers are intentionally lying, deceiving and skewing results. And that applies to all different trading platforms. So please visit the link that you see on the screen. So my complimentary offer to you is giving you 100% free unrestricted access to this powerful indicator and you will have access to it up until the end of December 2033. So really giving you a very long, decent period of time to use it and use it effectively. The good thing about this indicator is because of its high accuracy rates, you are going to be able to determine whether trading is suited to you or not. Because of the way that it works, the most important thing that you need to implement with it is money management and risk management. And if you can master those two things, then you will have success trading the futures market. So finally, you can get rid of all the useless tools that you've ever purchased or downloaded and use this one effective tool. And once you've gained effectiveness or once you have gained consistency with this tool, then you may want to look at the other tools that the DTB system has. Okay, so let's take a quick look at the indicator. And what you will notice, first of all, is that I have included a playlist on the YouTube channel of this indicator in action. And I've just recorded a few live sessions like yesterday, I recorded the 3.30 to 5 a.m. This is all New York times, 5 to 6 and 6 to 7. So those are all videos that I've just uploaded now to the channel. So feel free to go and review them. Let's have a quick look at what this indicator does. So we're going to scroll back just to the market open. Now you're going to notice that you're going to have some really bright colored bars and that is basically showing you significantly overbought conditions. You got this momentum line. So the very far right of the chart is where the momentum line is going to reflect in an accurate position. So the moment you see a momentum line facing down like this, you know there's a very high likelihood of the price reversing. So what happened is the price had slightly higher highs over here. We've had some divergences forming. The momentum line is showing down and that's the true value of what it's basically a predictor of what's going to happen, what's more likely to happen with the price. So as you can see, the price was, in st was still in buyer's territory. As soon as you see the bar coloring change to gold, you know the price is entering seller's territory. So there's a bit of a tug of war over here between the buyers and the sellers. You have a bit of um, you know, price action in this area. Momentum line is facing down. So a very high likelihood of this price reversing. And as you can notice, a few more highs. So what they, what they ultimately do, what the market makers and the and the institutions like doing is they like taking out stops 
before they push the price down or up. So we had a small little increase in the momentum line over there, but ultimately still showing down. And then we've had the sellers completely take over the market. So all these bars are gold, momentum line is down, and you'll see the price run all this way. And now the momentum line has, has come together with the price, meaning that there's likely a reversal to happen. So as you can see over there, we're still in seller's territory. Now we've got some green bars, which means the buyers have actually taken over. So we had a very long run from this area all the way down to here. It's 268 ticks. Buyers are in control. We had a small divergence. Look at the momentum line facing right up. You'll notice it, it peaked down a little bit. Seller's territory, buyers. So this is what the indicator is going to be plotting and a bit of indecision at this, at this range. So as soon as you're seeing an area where the, the bars are coloring green and gold, that means there's a major tug of war between the buyers and the sellers. So what you won't see on this chart, and this is really only for the subscribers of the DTB system, it kind of gives you an indication of why the price did what it did. So I'll bring up one of the other templates that I have. So this is the one of the templates that are available to DTB subscribers. And we'll scroll back to the beginning of the trading day again. And as you can see, the same thing over there, but we had a very strong Fibonacci level. So this is the four hour Fibonacci level, the 76.4. Now this indicator, this Fibonacci indicator is automatically plotted on the chart when it is selected. So there's quite a few different values within this Fibonacci indicator and it includes all the Fibonacci's from monthly all the way to five minutes and they are gonna automatically plot on the chart. So the last thing you wanna go do is go and move your Fibonacci level, scroll back and see where the highs and lows are this automatically plots it in place. And the good thing is, is that this, these are the levels that the institutions are looking at. So they are key levels to determine support and resistance of price. And again, DTB Traders is literally the only provider of a tool that automatically plots on the plot on the chart like this, which makes it very simple for you to be able to see what price is doing. So as you can see, it, it had a bit of support, a resistance around the 76. They were undecided what they were going to do, or should I say they were waiting to take out stops first. And as soon as it broke through that 76.4 level, the price had no resistance all the way down to the 61.8 and also the five minutes 76.4. So as soon as it, it came to that level, it basically had a point of reversal and that is what it is doing since and then what you will notice too is you'll notice a white line a red line a blue line so those are specific markers similar to this white dotted line on the complementary indicator but these are specific markers where significant volume has been pumped in the price pumped into the price to change direction so often it's a continuation, very often it's also a reversal. So these are definitely areas that are key to see on the chart. And as you can see now, we are just bouncing around this area. We've got some support and resistance over here. Okay, so that is the, the template. We'll quickly look at the NQ. So same thing happened on the NQ earlier. This is the complementary indicator showing you the different points of reversal. We've had some very nice um, points where, you know, trades can be entered, reversal places to enter. And as I mentioned, a bit of a tug of war between the buyers and the sellers. Let's have a look at the ES. So the ES, this is a 10 range chart. So different instruments move at different speeds in the market. So by changing the ES to a 10 range, we're able to better um, see what the price is doing compared to the NQ. So the NQ, we're going to run on a 20 during the slower sessions. 
ES will change that to a 10 because it is a much slower moving instrument. So right off the bat this morning at, at um, you know, 6 p.m. New York when the market opened, we actually had the complementary shutter trading indicator leave this marker behind. So that was a, a, a really powerful entry to enter into the market. And even if you just traded that indicator up until that marker was left behind, you're still looking at a 50 odd tick move, even if you just you know got out of that trade a bit late. And then we've got a small little divergence over here saying that there's a possible reversal. So this is what we're looking at on this chart this is the same chart again with our breakout markers. So, you know, a bit more information to determine entries. So a really cool tool to look at. Don't go and load multiple charts. Choose one specific contract, you know, like the MNQ, MES, and also start with those. You know, even if you've got a slightly larger account of five to whatever thousand dollars, still trade on the smaller contracts, the micro contracts, until you get a really good feel for this indicator. And then that's going to give you the confidence to switch over to the NQ where you can, you know, you enter much larger positions, and then you'll really be flying. So I hope you've enjoyed this introduction. So, um, you know, you're definitely going to be paying attention to what the price is doing. Have a look at these arrows on the chart. They are a key, key influence on what price is going to do. Don't go and act on every single arrow. So, you know, if you go and buy and sell based on every single arrow, you know, that is definitely not the way to trade it. In summary, this indicator is really going to make trading a lot more simple and effective. The Arrows and divergences are extremely powerful when entering positions. The white dotted line being left behind really gives confirmation of those signals. And there is also a good amount of training documents and videos to help you work with this indicator and understand it better. And then once you have mastered it, then you can look at the DTB system, the complete system, which includes over 60 powerful indicators and automated strategies. And this is all on a single subscription. So once you've mastered this indicator, I certainly look forward to working with you further. And for those looking to extend their toolkit further, please visit the link above and you will be very happy you found us. So thank you for your time in watching this video. Please like it, please subscribe and share it with others who would benefit from it. Thank you very much for your time and goodbye.